Hey guys, Trevor Goodge here today with all back with season two, episode nine of Scam. So last episode we left off on a little cliffhanger of Will is not going to sleep with the brother, and that's what's going to fuck over everything. The intense, intensity of last season was uh, last episode was really fucking good. Um, overall, yeah, I just really want to jump in to see what sort of cliffhanger they left us on. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed the reaction, if you do, leave a like, subscribe, and let's check out Patreon for the timing reactions along with early access. And let's jump into some more scam. See, he basically manipulated him into drinking. That's true manipulation. Uh, he kept prep trying to get it to drink wine, and he tells her that story and gives it a wine again, knowing it probably get it to drink. Oh, Will, you don't send a message like that after just watching after just what happened. Oh, mate. <laughs> William, your brother fucked you over. This is why he probably wanted to keep his brother away from her. Because he's probably done this before to girls he's liked. No. Technically, it would be if he did. Would he be that stupid to do. Because, yeah, she could pull sexual assault on him if he fucking did do it. Oh, this is a cool, quite realistic drama they're touching on here. <laughs> yeah, awkward. Um, oh, she could talk to the chick, to be fair. The one from the school. She was in the bed, weren't she? <laughs> He's there. Gonna have to confront him now. <laughs> nah, he ghosted me. Everything was going so well. Why did she have to go get drunk with the brother? For fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, she caused some more. Why did you have to go full aggression mode all the time? <laughs> Fuck's sake. He's getting so many mixed signals right now, I feel for him. She's gonna blow. You can tell she's that frustrated. Fuck it out. What the fuck did I just say? Look she just... Look she just added that in, that kind of true. <laughs> oh, she got to her advice. When it's fucking Vilda to get into one to eat? Mate. The war. Oh no, the gang's coming. She's there with a trackie as well. She's gonna kick shit. Vilda's <laughs> reaction. The scream. <laughs> That was so unnecessary. <laughs> right, relief. Oh, now the ambush of Wilhelm. Can we finally progress? <laughs> Chris is just like, for fuck's sake, man. I'm waiting for a second message to come through and I'll be like, Oh no, I remember now! <laughs> ah, we'll see. That's going to come back and bite us in the ass though later. Either soon or later. Do, 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 do. Oh, 
But he has the bros. I feel you, man. The bros for life. It's all coming together now. His brother is definitely a minute player. Like, if you're going to call someone a minute player, that is the key. Because that's how they act. So hold on, put it the fuck you up. Which he did, sort of. And that's why I'm not so brown hair. I'm not even that family now, though. That's a bit shit, isn't it? Fuck now. Well, he sort of, uh, you know, he did do his little manipulated. I hope she did have sex with him. And she was just lying there. It's just because she was naked, which froze me off. Here we go, make up kiss. We're back together now. We're going to head off on a happy note, or is it going to do some more drama? Oh, it's going to be messaged again. It's going to leave off on something, in it? Uh, it's coming. That's fucking rapey as fuck, mate. Taking a picture of her. <laughs> mate, that's two episodes of ending off on cliffhangers. I give it that. The seasons, the seasons definitely had way better cliffhangers this season. Like fucking hell, that's two in a row. So <sighs> that's bad if that gets out, especially with Wilhelm's sort of attitude towards his brother. Um, I think the only way we could confirm anything is a girl. Yeah, the other girl was at the party, so I wonder if, she can, if he's got anything to say about it. But, yeah, I'm like how they're fixing up other dramas, but they brought in some new decent ones. And also, because they built up the brother, they set up the brother a bit early on in the season, it feels a lot better than if he just, she just met him. I'm glad they put the brother in early and had that conflict a bit early on in the season than just without it, because it makes it so much more interesting with the brother. Um... And then he sort of got a bit more of William's perspective on how much he his friends mean to him, um, why he did what he did, um, why he does it, his sort of puts up with his brother because it's sort of the only family he's got. And yeah, I like William. The more you learn about the guy, the more you like him. You can't not love the guy. Um, I look forward to see what's, what is, how horrible this is going to go. Like, Yeah, I think this could be definitely a next fun couple episodes. The drama's feeling like dead of real as well. It doesn't feel like over the top or just wacky. It feels like quite real drama that someone could have. I do like the realisticness of that. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed the action, do leave a like, subscribe, and hope to see you next week. Peace.